This is MSG. Clay Aiken, he didn't even win American Idol, but he's become one of the more famous of the show's contestants. He's taken center stage in Spamalot, and Jill Martin goes backstage later in our newest edition of Showtime. Grail to Monty Python. Jill Martin next takes us behind the scenes of Spamalot in this week's edition of Showtime. Wednesday, we'll turn them up. That's the lights that is on uh, MSGNY. This week, Jill Martin behind the scenes of Monty Python's Spamalot to find out what goes into the making of that hit Broadway show. Well, if you are ready to laugh and then laugh some more, this week's Showtime is for you. Like all these people, we are checking out Monty Python's Spamalot. If life seems jolly run, there's something you forgot. And that's to laugh and smile and dance and sing. Cue the flying cows, the lady of the lake, and the dancing cirques. And always look on the bright side of life. It's the hit Broadway show Spamalot, a musical based on the film Monty Python and the Holy Grail. I'm not sure we're allowed sporty type people in theatre places. <laughs> I'll let you in just this once. Hannah Waddingham gives us a backstage tour just before showtime. Some of the guys may want to look at some yes, of these costumes. Of course it. <laughs> Hannah starred in the original production of Spamalot in London. I've never been in a show where people literally laugh from like a minute into the uh, overture right till the end of the show. And every night, everyone's standing up in their seats. The Blonde Beauty came to perform on Broadway for the first time this past January. <laughs> Tell me about Super your first time exciting. on Broadway. It was insane. I wasn't quite expecting. I opened with uh, Clay Aiken on the 18th of January. So to be fair, I could have been completely naked and with a, I don't know, with like a plant pot on my head and nobody would have noticed that night. And I too have found my grail. What's that? Musical theatre. Did you even know who Clay Aiken no, was? No, didn't have a clue. We have Pop Idol. It originated in London, so we have Pop Idol over there and then it's called American Idol here. But you didn't, I mean, Clay here well, is like... Yeah, Clay is like, it was like Elvis is in the building. Which is really, I found it really funny. I was like, mm, okay. <laughs> Aiken plays a lad who so badly wants to become a knight. Hannah stars as the Lady of the Lake. I basically play Arthur's prophet guide throughout the show. Whenever he's having a moment of indecision or whatever, I come along in some ridiculous costume, usually with lots of cleavage, and, um, and sing some insane song. <laughs> It's a song that goes like this. So this is where I have to come rushing down, like stripping everything off to get changed. And we come in here. This is the wardrobe department. Hannah has just a minute and a half to go from one costume to another. I literally come running down. I get stripped off by somebody else, step into the dress, headdress goes on, and I'm back up through the floor holding the grail. It's action here. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's, all, it's, it's action. action. We're, almost, we're almost at showtime. Yeah, we, we really are. But before we go, one more quick tour. These are my beautiful wigs right here. Yes. Clay's balls the already? Priest. <laughs> yeah, he is. He's really let himself go. God, that American Idol. It's embarrassing. I felt like it was just last year. I think it must have been the stress. <laughs> but if you are in need of a stress reliever, this Tony Award winning show is definitely the ticket for you. Well, I am sure that our sports guys watching are very happy that they yes. get to spend some time with you. Absolutely, and come down to see the show and say hi. Always look on the bright side of life. And if you want to keep on laughing, just log on to MontyPythonSpamalot.com for more information. For MSGNY, I'm Jill Martin.